Okay, the easy way to do it is to subtract 1 from 0.89, which leaves you with 11%. And then 11% is alpha divided by 2, gives you 5.5% in each tail. So what we'll do is open up StatCrunch, go to the normal calculator, the mean standard deviation, and we want 5.5% over here in the tail. So we'll change this to right and we'll just put 5.5%. Okay, 5.5%. And the critical value would be one point, let's see, two decimal places. Uh, well, that'd be 1.60. So 1.6. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll do one more here. So this time we've got 14%. So 1 minus 0.86 gives you 14%. So that's split into, I have to divide that by 2, so 7%. So let's try it again. So this time we want 7%. Okay, so 1.48, 1.48. Okay, and you can play around, do multiples of these. Okay, next section we'll do uh, 9.2, and I'll show you how to do the T distribution. So let's do one of those. Okay, uh, now again here it's telling us the area on the right tail is 0 0.005 with 23 degrees of freedom. So we'll do stack crunch, stack crunch. This time we'll use the T distribution. And we've got degrees of freedom is 23, 23. And the area in the right tail is 0 .005, 0 .005, and compute. So the critical value here would be 2.81 to two decimal places, three decimal places. So 2.807, 2.807, okay, all right. So let's see here, find the T value, the area in the right tail. Again, real easy, you just change the degrees of freedom. 23, change the area to 0 0.02. So change that to point, point oh two. Okay, so 2.177, 2.77. Find the T value such that the area left is, okay, well, we can use symmetry, but um, since, it won't, since it wants the area to the left, We'll just go ahead and use that. So six degrees of freedom, 0.05. So we'll change that to the left tail. Six degrees of freedom, 0.05. And we get minus 1.943. Minus 1.943. Okay. And then find the corresponds to 70% confidence. Now here, to do this question, we have to know that 70% confidence means that 70% is in the center. So that means 30% is split into the two tails. Um, so 30% divided by 2 is 15%. 27 degrees of freedom. So we'll use the right tail, 27 degrees of freedom, and 15%. So 1.057. 1.057. You'll always use the positive whenever it asks you for 70% uh, confidence or 80 or 84% confidence. You'll always use the positive uh, here. Okay. All right. So hope this helps.